What's up guys? In this video, what's up guys? We have been waiting a long, long, long time for this. It is finally here. Flash for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. I'm serious. Flash. Uh, it's not actually a full working flash. It's still uh, in the beta like, process. It's it's kind of a new application or a new uh, add-on to Safari. So give it a little while for it. It's actually working with everything, uh, but I think it's going to get there. It's actually pretty good. So it's a really quick install. I'm going to show you how to install flash on your iPhone or iPod Touch or iPad. Now, of course, it does need to be jailbroken. So before you do this, you're going to have to be jailbroken. If you don't know how to do that, click right here and then put a little video right beside the iPhone uh, and you can click it to jailbreak your iPad, iPhone, or iPod Touch. Now, I'm not sure if this works on the iPod Touch second generation or first generation. I'm pretty sure it does work on the iPod Touch 3G. I can't actually try it though because jailbreakme.com keeps crashing on my third generation iPod Touch so can't really do nothing about that to prove to you guys or to show to you guys it does work. Anyways, let's get on with this. Have your iPhone or iPod or iPad jailbroken. Open it up. Uh, this iPhone is running 4.0.1 so if you're watching this video at a later date and uh, you're on a higher firmware it may not work I'm not sure until they update it anyways let's go into Cydia I'm gonna go ahead and go into manage sources and you're basically just gonna have to add a repo to your phone let's zoom in just a little bit here okay I'm gonna go to edit add and then you're gonna type in the source I'll have it below the video in the description right down there uh, if you can't read it on the screen repo so repo dot ben b e n M dot a t so repo dot benham dot a t so I've already added it just hit add source I've already done it so I don't need to do that give it a second to reload the sources and do all that update the sources and then you're going to go ahead and hit uh, return to Cydia and then go ahead and hit done and then hit benham dot a t repo so you're going to go into the repo and here's all the packages you see now let me go ahead and explain these really quick. Uh, Frash is the actual Flash uh, plugin for Safari and what this is going to do is this is an SB settings toggle. I don't know if you guys know what SB settings is. Uh, it's not actually letting me open it up right now. I don't know why it's not doing that. I guess I can open it in Cydia. But SB settings is basically a way to turn things like Frash on and off. Uh, and you're going to want to install that after you install Flash because that's an easy way like if Safari is going slow for you or you don't want it to load up Flash or anything uh, that will definitely make it quicker by turning off Flash. So what we're going to do first is go ahead and install Flash, hit install, confirm and go ahead and let that install. Uh, it shouldn't take very long. Go ahead and let it download and I'm going to come back. Alright, return to Cydia. Now before we do the rebooting process which you have to do uh, what I'm going to recommend you do is go ahead and install this uh, Flash uh, Flash toggle. Uh, this, even if you don't have SB settings, this is going to go ahead and install SB settings for you. So go ahead and go into Flash toggle and install that, and it will install SB settings for you. So you don't have to go in and install SB settings or anything. Okay, let's let it reload the data. Okay, restart Springboard. And actually, after it gets done restarting Springboard, what we're going to do is reboot our phone so Flash uh, will actually work for us. So I'm just going to hit Cancel, and I'm going to hold the power button in, and I'm going to reboot. Alright, so my phone is now rebooted. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and go into Safari, and I'm going to show you that this is working. So let's go ahead and open this up and close it out, and we're going to go to Home, Star, run or dot com because that is a site that has flash and basically you see uh, everywhere where you're gonna see a flash uh, like a flash embedded flash thing uh, before where you wouldn't see anything or you just see an empty box with a blue little square in it or whatever it was uh, you're gonna see this it's basically just a gray square uh, that says flash and what you gotta do is just tap on it I already did on accident I'll zoom in just a little bit and you see that the frash the frash player is working and it is playing flash let's turn it up I think I have mine muted now actually let's go ahead and hit come on in it does work and like you see I have to type it again right here after I hit that but you can see that it is working I think you'll be able to hear some audio here in a second I'm not sure okay it does have audio in it but for some reason it's not wanting to work for me 
Uh, but it is a full flash, basically. Like, you can hear audio, the animations on this thing at least look pretty good. Like, there's no lag at all in it. And that's basically how you install flash on your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. As I said before, uh, it doesn't really work on the iPod Touch second generation, I don't think. I think it's because of the processors in it. It can't work. Uh, and you can do this on an iPod or an iPhone 3G, but I think it's like really slow. Like the lower devices you get, the slower it's going to be. So the best it's going to work is on the iPhone 4 and the iPad. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Sorry I was a little bit late with this video. I know this sec actually this information was out about a week ago, uh, but I wanted to do this video for you guys, and that's about it. Now I want to show you guys this really cool. Uh, they're really funny actually. So I left for New Jersey. Uh, and I was gone probably like a month, a little bit over a month, and I came back. This is my old cracked iPod Touch second generation, and this is what it says when I click my iPod. iPod is disabled. Try again in 21,322 minutes. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Nobody touched my iPod. I just wanted to show you guys that. I thought it was pretty funny. That's what he came back. That's what it said when I came back. Anyways. Enjoy Flash on your iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. See you guys in the next video. Don't forget to hit the little subscribe button up there for more videos like this. And peace.